it is high time Это очень важное время for us to get ready Мы должны сейчас приготовиться for the last message in this conference для последней проповеди на этой конференции from the person that is eventually going to become your father от человека, который впоследствии станет вашим отцом not just mine не, не только моим отцом духовным <laughs> So, because if I, if God shows him to bring me to the kingdom, and, you know, shows me to bring you to the kingdom, like it or not, you are his grandchildren. Потому что если Бог, Он избрал этого человека для того, чтобы привести меня к Богу, то как бы вы там этого не хотели или хотели, но Он ваш духовный дедушка. So, he's, he's your grandfather. Он ваш духовный дедушка, и вы его внуки. Are you happy that you could be related to a man of God that is as that is as great in the spirit are you happy to be related to such a man счастливы ли вы иметь такое родство с настолько великим в Боге великим в духе человеком счастливы ли вы now before I bring Pastor Kumuyi forward Прежде чем я приглашу пастора Кумуи, yesterday I promised to uh, listen to let us hear the testimony of the lady that was washing in America, in Atlanta, and got healed while he was preaching here in Kiev. Вчера я обещал вам, что мы будем слушать свидетельство одной женщины, которая сидя перед своим компьютером в Америке, в Атланте, смотрела наше служение и получила исцеление. And the husband is here to give that testimony. Ее муж здесь сегодня, чтобы свидетельствовать от ее имени. So, Pastor Alex. Pastor Alex. Will you, you, will you speak in English so that we don't, I don't need to speak for you? Пожалуйста, говорите на английском, чтобы вас могли понимать гости. Yes, I'm here to testify of the God's glory. Uh, that is here. Я здесь, чтобы свидетельствовать о Божьей славе, которая проявляется здесь. And the God's glory not only here, it spreads all over the world through here. И знаете, Божья слава не только здесь, но она распространяется по всему миру отсюда. My wife uh, 14 days ago 14 days ago gave a birth to a, a baby boy. Знаете, 14 дней назад моя супруга родила нам мальчика, сына. Because of that, because of the birth and labor, she had a, uh, complications and serious complications. И знаете, к сожалению, после родов у нее были очень серьезные осложнения. And she asked me to buy here in the pharmacies a, a medicine because the medicine here is a lot cheaper than in the United States. И она мне позвонила и попросила купить здесь в аптеке лекарства определенные, потому что здесь она намного дешевле, чем в Америке. Yes, and at the first service when uh, Pastor Kumui was preaching, he released the word of knowledge. И на первом служении, на котором служил пастор Кумуи, он высвободил слово знания. And I knew it in my spirit that this is for my wife. И я знал в духе, что это для моей жены. And my wife was watching it online. И моя жена смотрела прямую трансляцию. And she sent a text message to me, I'm healed. She checked herself. And she was healed completely, instantly. И моя жена, она прислала мне смс-ку. Она написала, что Бог исцелил меня абсолютно полностью. Аллилуйя! So the walls of this place is not a barrier for the God's glory. It spreads all over the world. Стены этого здания, они не ограничивают Божью славу, но она распространяется по всему миру отсюда. And God using this church, God embassy to bless other people. И Бог использует эту церковь, посольство Божье, чтобы благословлять других людей. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, I think with all honor to God. И со всем почтением к Богу. You know, now, this is not because of, uh, you, you just understand what I'm about to say. When I was 19 years old, Знаете, когда мне было 19 лет, I got a scholarship, just six months after I got born again, I got a scholarship 
to Russia to study. Через шесть месяцев после того, как я пришел к Богу, я получил стипендию на обучение в Советском Союзе. Of course, you already know I got saved by watching Pastor Kumi uh, on TV. Вы знаете, да, уже как это произошло. Я смотрел телепередачу пастора Куму и пришел к Господу через нее. And uh, six months later, you know, I had applied for a scholarship because of the results I had, thank God, and also because I could not, well, from such a family that there was no way I could go to university in Nigeria. I got admission to Nigeria, but I couldn't just sustain myself. I couldn't even get money to, tr to transport myself from my village to the city where this university was. И у меня были хорошие результаты, когда я кончил школу, у меня были хорошие оценки. И я даже поступил в университет в Нигерии, но, к сожалению, моя семья не могла обеспечить меня финансово для того, чтобы учиться. Я даже не мог, к сожалению, оплатить свою дорогу до университета. И поэтому я подал документы на бесплатную стипендию на обучение за рубежом. Graduating examination was paid just 15 naira. All our family relatives they couldn't come together with 15 naira. И даже честно говоря, я не помню, каким образом нам удалось заплатить за диплом в школе просто какие-то административные расходы. Это была очень очень маленькая незначительная сумма для того, чтобы оплатить получение диплома в школе. Я даже не помню, как мы смогли покрыть эти расходы. But because I was a good student and uh, You know, there were, I don't know, some people gathered together that $50, those $50, I'm 50 naira. And, uh, you know, they just called me in to give my exams. And God helped me that way. So, even to get transportation money to the university, even though I, well, I got the, that university, they call it University of FIFA, they used to call it. And I was just not far. My state was just nearby. Yet, I had the third best result in the whole examination going to the university. But still, I couldn't go. И uh, несмотря на то, что uh, результаты моих экзаменов, я был третьим лучшим студентом по всей стране, но, к сожалению, я не мог оплатить свою учебу. So I was sitting down at home, just watching current affairs. That was some of the things I was interested in, <laughs> because you know, I had finished. I was trying to work, and you know, just sitting down to watch news to really be current with what was going on in the world. But I was not religious, you know. I didn't know there was a living God. We were, we were born in the Anglican church, but nothing more. But after this program this day, there was this religious program that was coming up, but this was not the normal religious program. И после того, как я уже сдал экзамены, к сожалению, не получалось у меня поступать на учебу, я не мог оплатить свою учебу. Однажды я сидел дома и просто смотрел новости из-за рубежа, потому что это то, чем я интересовался, я хотел быть в курсе событий. И после новостной телепередачи началась другая передача. И я вообще-то не был набожным каким-то, я не верил в Бога, но началась христианская передача, и она была какой-то другой, отличалась от тех христианских передач, которые я видел раньше by saying this Pastor Kumuyi that is about to preach was a don of the Faculty of Mathematics at the University of Lagos. I said, now, that might, that might be interesting. How could he be a mathematician and now wants to preach? Let me hear what he has to say. И то, что меня заинтересовало, то, что приковало мое внимание, это в начале передачи они э, представили пастора Кумуи и сказали, что он является ученым, профессором математики. Я подумала, хм, интересно, как ты можешь быть профессором математики и проповедовать? Но это надо посмотреть. To That was the cash. И это было что-то. Christianity is not for Africans. Look at how poor we are. You know, it's for Europeans. They use it to colonize us. You know, I was all in all that. И знаете, в тот момент у меня было куча всяких ограничений в голове. Многие говорили в то время, что христианство это вообще для европейцев, для белых людей, это не для африканцев, потому что если бы оно было для нас, мы бы не были такими бедными. Поэтому в то время я вот так и мыслил. But here was somebody who was saying, God is good, and I was asking him, I was just throwing myself the question, if he's good. Why should I be living in such poverty that I'm living if it's good? How could I finish best in my school, my state, and still not be able to go to university? If it's good, why don't I have shoes? I was 19 years old. If it's good, why should I be hawking pap 
at 18 and 19 just to be able to go about feeding myself. So, but he was saying, all evil, I never had that concept before, that the evil things that happen to you, they are not coming from God, but there is a devil which is evil, and it is the author of all the evil things. I still remember 25 years after. И я слушал пастора Куму эту телепередачу, и вот он сказал, что Бог, он благой Бог. Я тогда подумал, ну как Бог может быть благим, если я вот здесь сижу, у меня нет даже обуви, у меня нет денег, чтобы заплатить за свое образование, я настолько беден, как вообще благой Бог он может допустить такое? Но пастор Куму и сказал что-то. Он сказал, что всякое даяние доброе, оно исходит от Бога, а все, все нехорошие вещи, которые приключаются с вами, они исходят от дьявола. So I said, okay, I will remember the point because he was start catching my attention. Then after his message, people began to testify. He died, really got my attention. I said, so God could do miracle. Now I'm going to give it a try. И я запомнил некоторые пункты из его проповеди, из его учения. И после учения люди начали свидетельствовать о чудесах в их жизнях. И это то, что действительно привлекло мое внимание. Я подумал, ну, надо попробовать. I said, you know, you know, being a uh, young radical. I said I was not going to repeat the prayer of salvation after him. I was just going to do it on my own and try if that God was real. Guess what? He came to my room. I had put off the light because it was in the night. You know, just I was ashamed that, you know, put off the light so that I would just be in darkness to pray. But as soon as I finished praying that prayer of salvation, a light filled the whole room. If I said, what happened? Who put the light? The light was not on. Just came from just white light. I wear yellow light like this. And I was wondering what was happening. I began to weep. Then I felt like 200 kilograms of weight had just fallen off my shoulder. I felt light. And I felt like I was washed from within as if every cell of my bo- in my body was washed, cleaned. I came out from that room. The, I saw the trees. I, could, I had not noticed before in my life, I was 19, that the trees were green, leaves green, sky blue. I said something that happened to this man. <laughs> Пастор Кумуи, он предложил в конце своей телепередачи помолиться вместе о том, чтобы Бог, он вошел в мое сердце. Но я сказал себе тогда, ну нет, повторять за ним я не буду. Но я запомнил некоторые пункты молитвы. И после окончания передачи я зашел к себе в комнату. Я очень стеснялся, так что ну, я буду молиться. Поэтому я выключил даже свет, чтобы тихонечко в темноте, чтобы никто не видел, помолиться. И вот я в своей темной комнате молюсь. И представляете, неожиданно я вижу такой прекрасный, Красный белый свет, даже не такой, как свет электричества, желтоватый, но яркий белый свет. И я думаю, что такое, кто включил свет? Это Иисус пришел ко мне, когда я молился Ему, когда я отдал Ему свое сердце. И в тот момент я почувствовал, как будто, наверное, 200 килограмм груза свалилось с моих плеч. Я почувствовал, что он действительно омыл меня, очистил меня. Я буквально почувствовал, как каждая клеточка моего тела, она очистилась. И после того, как я пережил эту незабываемую встречу с Господом, я вышел на улицу на следующее утро, и впервые за 19 лет своей жизни я обнаружил, что... Деревья оказываются зеленые, небо оказывается голубое, мир вообще такой потрясающий, красивый. I woke up in the morning. I said, I pray they will have this church in Ijebode where I was living. I, I mean, just that was just a kilometer from my village, so I was saying, oh, two kilometers. I, I, so I went out the, the next day from nine o'clock in the morning. I walked throughout the city, the bigger city, the bigger town, from nine in the morning to five in the afternoon. I couldn't find the church. Then as I was frustrated going home, that was 25 years ago, I was just walking, you know, no transport, thank God, no money for that one. So as I was just walking, I saw a paper, you know, colorful paper, you know, in my village there are not too many colorful things. So I said, this one took my attention. So I picked that colorful paper and I saw it there, you know, written, we have moved. Deeper Christian life Bible, you know, deeper Bible, you know, live Bible church. They had just moved. And I was just beside the new site they had moved to. I didn't go home. I abandoned house. I abandoned everything. I just went to look for them. It was a Thursday. I never knew they were having a service. <laughs> 
И а, я решил найти церковь, дочернюю церковь пастора Кумуи. Я помнила в телепередаче, что одна из его дочерних церквей, она находится а, в городке а, буквально один километр от того места, где я жил. Поэтому на следующий день я решил найти эту церковь. Я по пошел туда, и я провел буквально целый день в поисках этой церкви. С 10 утра до 5 часов вечера я ходил в этом городе, пытаясь найти эту церковь, и я не мог ее найти. И уже вечером я был настолько разочарован, уставший, и я уже пешком возвращался домой, транспорта нет, ну, в любом случае, денег на транспорт все равно не было. Поэтому я возвращался пешком домой, и тут мое внимание привлекла такая э, цветная бумажечка, такой цветной флаер. Ну, там, где я живу, там не очень много цветных красивых вещей э, в моей деревеньке. Поэтому я взял ее, чтобы почитать. И знаете, что я там увидел? На этом флаере было написано, что церковь, которую я искал, только что переехала в другое место. И я находился буквально напротив этой церкви. Я даже не знал об этом. И это как раз был четверг, когда там было служение. No accidents with God. У Бога не бывает случайностей. So I was going to that church for the next six months. И я ходил верно, посещал эту церковь на протяжении следующих шести месяцев. Before the result came, then I had two scholarships at the same time: one to America, one to Russia. И к концу этих шести месяцев я получил результаты своих экзаменов, э, вот заявок, которые я подавал, и я э, получил дв два приглашения, одно в Америку и одно в Советский Союз. But he said, if you go to America, there are a lot, of, that is a lot of materialism, a lot of temptations, a lot of trials, a lot of, you know, just pleasure. And it's, it's for a young man like you, you might get distracted. But if you go to Russia, it's difficult. No God there, even there is Siberia. But if you survive it in that place, you will survive it anyway. You make it to heaven. I said, hey, that is the place I want. He didn't say you should go to there or there. He just, said, he just gave me information. And I like challenges. So I just said, that is the one I want. I would rather go to Siberia, but make it to heaven, or for that, that fall into sin in Africa. <laughs> И я получил эти две стипендии на обучение, одну в Советском Союзе и одну в Америке. Я не знал, какое место выбрать. Я взял обе, оба приглашения и пришел к своему пастору. Я спросил, пастор, что мне делать, куда ехать? Пастор не дал мне конкретного ответа, но он объяснил мне кое-что очень интересное. Он сказал, знаешь, конечно же, легче и приятнее поехать в Америку, но... Там материализм просто процветает. И для такого молодого человека, как ты, будет множество искушений. Будет множество вещей, которые собьют тебя с фокуса. Но в Советском Союзе там действительно очень тяжело будет. Но если ты выживешь там, то ты точно попадешь на небо. А я... А я, вы меня знаете, я вызовы очень люблю, поэтому я сказал, Боже, вот это как раз то место, которое нужно. Я хочу попасть на небо. И поехал в Советский Союз. Пасторы посольства Божье, очень важно, чтобы мы делали ударение на правильных вещах, на небе. И небо – это единственная вещь, которая имеет значение, на которой нужно делать ударение. And so, anyway, I got to Russia, and I saw the situation of things that, right, well, you know, passion is one thing, enthusiasm is one thing, but reality is another thing. When I came to Russia, and I saw the reality of things on the ground, no believers, no church, no pastors, no Christians, I refused to leave the hotel, because I, was, I wanted to pray, they said no, I wanted to go to church, they said no, they would catch me. So I gathered some foreigners, who had began to pray, but I also remember, that was temptation, you see. I also remember I still had the scholarship to America, so I said I was going to go back home. And quickly go and do that one. But you see, one person that was a believer there, who was on the underground church, a senior guy who had been studying here, but underground, he told me, don't take a rush decision. 
why don't you pray and ask God? God speaks. He will speak to you why he had allowed you to come here, not to America. So keep on praying. He will, and he just said, pray every day about it. So I took that as a challenge. I was praying morning, afternoon, evening. Just one prayer request. God, why did you send me here for two weeks? And you hear what happened. И поэтому, когда, ну, я вообще-то готов был поехать даже в Сибирь. Я ехал такой решительно настроенный, но когда я приехал в Советский Союз, знаете, страсть, конечно, это одна вещь, но когда я увидел реальность, это было совершенно другое. То есть, когда я понял, что молиться нельзя, читать Библию нельзя, то есть тебя посадят в тюрьму за то, что ты говоришь о Боге, я вообще не хотел выходить из гостиницы. Я старался быть поближе к своим коллегам иностранцам, там, где хотя бы можно было говорить о Боге. И, вы знаете, у меня было такое искушение, такое, то, что можно было бы принять за а, такую помощь от Бога, в кавычках. То есть я еще помнил о том, что у меня есть вторая стипендия в Америку, и можно было все-таки еще вернуться домой и поехать туда. И я уже подумывал об этом, но я посоветовался с одним из э, старших своих друзей, и он сказал мне, знаешь, э, почему бы тебе не послушать Бога? Бог не зря привел тебя сюда, и лучше всего быть в том месте, где Бог хочет тебя видеть. Поэтому просто молись и послушай Бога. И поэтому следующие дни я молился только одной молитвой с утра до вечера. Боже, что мне делать? So, well, after two weeks I had an encounter for the first time in my life. I never had a dream, I never had a vision. I was 19. But three days consecutively I had Jesus walk into my room, took me like this, and I found myself in a crusade ground where Pastor Kumui was ministering. I will not tell you the details, but I knew I was going to meet with him. And uh, three days consecutively, the first day it happened, the second day it happened, the third day it happened, and, you know, Jesus was there with us. And, you know, we did, all the things happened, but I could still not believe, even though Jesus walked and took me and showed me my future, my destiny, and what was going to happen, that it was going to be connected Pastor Kumui, he was so great. I, I, I just didn't see how that could ever come to pass. И через две недели моих молитв Иисус, Он лично явился ко мне. И на протяжении трех дней Он приходил ко мне каждый день. И Он взял меня и показал мне служение. Это было служение пастора Кумуи, там было много людей. И я знал, что Бог, Он призвал меня на служение. Я понятия не имел, как это произойдет. Я не знал, что делать, но я точно знал, что мне нужно остаться. You will not believe this. I, what I thought is not possible. I said, I was 19. This was 25 years ago. That we would stand on the same stage with the person who I've regarded as a, a legion, which is really true, and almost at a point as second to God himself. <laughs> Maybe it's too much, but uh, that was, you know, how it was at that time, you see. И знаете, я не мог бы поверить, если бы кто-то сказал мне об этом в то время, это было 25 лет назад, о том, что через какое-то время я буду вообще стоять на одной сцене с этим человеком, человеком, который для меня тогда был, наверное, на втором месте после Бога. Я даже не знал, что Бог сможет сделать такое чудо. To come down, knowing me that I'm his son, and say, Come, I want to partner with you. Where is your church? Let's come and do this work together. Can you imagine what I've been feeling these three days? Help me welcome our Father in the Lord. И я не мог себе даже, даже представить, что этот муж Божий настолько высокий, но настолько смиренный. Он приедет ко мне, как к своему сыну, и он будет сотрудничать на Ниве Божьей. Давайте поприветствуем пастора Кумуи. Praise the Lord. Thank you very much. Спасибо вам большое. Pastor Sunday and Pastor Bosse. Pastor Sunday, Pastor Bosse. 
It's a great privilege to fellowship with you and to minister in the church. When God raises up a man and gives a vision and you know that that vision is from God, whatever God tells you to do, join hands together, run together, and fulfill the vision together, and say the will of the Lord be done. And Pastor Sunday, Pastor Sunday, I want to appreciate your faithfulness to God and also your humility that for your scrumness. Sometimes great men don't tell the kind of stories you tell. In Agda Veliki Eludi, Katode Ujestali Veliki Kakte, Ni Lubia Traskazavat Aswoi Proshte. When people are successful, Kagda Ludi Ujo Speshne, hide their past. And it's Krevaius for your Proshte. So that the rest of us, Shobi me, Prasti Eludi, can never be like them. Magli Dumash to Yata Kibu Jenica Danistano. But thank God for the humility of this great man of God. Smirania et of a Muja, Velika Muja Boja. To talk about the past. Katode Rask and no. So that you and I, who might have thought, we cannot achieve what the great man of God has achieved. All know that if God can raise him up, no time has come. So God can raise him up. God can raise him up. God can raise him up. God makes a zero to be a hero. Bog privrashae nul giroya. From zero to a hero. Gnalea na giroya. And you cannot be less than a zero. Tenemojes bit ninja nalea. Something great has started in your life already. Ribiata, uvas, vashe shuda, vashe paseshene ujena shalos. There is a miracle of reproduction. With that, yes, taku is shuda ras nojeni. Everything you have heard about him. Sio shove slisha le ot nivo. Everything you have heard about me. Sio shove uslisha le abamne. A miracle of reproduction coming your way. Eta shuda ras nojeni eta idio dotebiya. The first message. I spoke about the kingdom faith. Second message. I spoke about kingdom citizens. My third message. I spoke about kingdom authority. Now I'm going to finalize the whole series by talking on the kingdom key. We need the key to open the door. You might be short, yes, no, be tall, slim, black. Yellow, brown, no bella coge, white, highly intelligent, not as intelligent as other people. If you have the key. Nobody can stop you from entering the door. If you have the key, nobody can hinder from opening that door. Forget about who you are. All you need is a key. And once you have the key, you have the solution to all those problems. I want you to pray. Just a simple prayer that during this message God will hand over that key into your hand and then you go out of here you open every locked door. Every door you are going to open. All you need is a key. Almighty God, we thank you for this hour. We thank you for this moment. We thank you for Pastor Sunday. Thank you for Pastor Bosse. Thank you for the Apostolic Council. Thank you for the men and women. 
мужчин и женщин, которые совершают твое видение. Господь, мы молимся, чтобы чудо размножения пришло. Посольство Божие. Господь, мы молимся, чтобы ты размножил служение и жизнь каждого во имя Иисуса. Господь, мы молимся сегодня, чтобы ты дал этот ключ каждому. Господь, мы молимся, открой наши сердца и наши глаза, чтобы мы видели. Дай нам, Господь, сегодня во имя Иисуса. Аминь. И весь народ закрышит. Thank you very much. We can sit down. Спасибо, вы можете присесть. Сделайте его микрофон лучше, чтобы лучше мы читали. We're taking the text of scripture from Matthew chapter 16. Матфея 16 глава. I was reading two verses of scriptures there. Мы будем читать два стиха. Verse 18 and verse 19. 18 19 стихи. Here is Jesus Christ speaking. И здесь Иисус Христос говорит. He spoke to Peter. Он проговорил Петру. My intention is talking to you. И он вам тоже говорит. And I say also unto thee. И я говорю тебе. That thou art Peter. Te Peter. And upon this rock I will build my church. И на всем камне я создам церковь твою. And the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. И врата ада не одолеют против нее. Jesus said he was building his church. Господь Иисус говорил он построил церковь свою. And still building the church today. И он все еще строит свою церковь сегодня. And the church of Jesus Christ. И церковь Иисуса. Cannot be destroyed by Satan. Не сможет быть остановлена дьяволом. By the very gates of hell. И даже ад не сможет его остановить. Потом он нам говорит. В девятнадцатом И дам тебе ключи. Царство небесного. И что свяжешь. На земле. Shall be bound in heaven. And whatsoever thou shalt lose on earth, shall be loosed in heaven. When we are talking about the influence of God's kingdom in society, and we need to know where we are going to have the influence. You think about the society. If you check up in the English Bible. Если вы просмотрите английскую Библию, that is, if you check up in the King James version that I use, но Святого Якова версии, you will not find the word society. Там мы не найдем слово общество. But don't let that disturb you. Но я не хочу вас мучать. Well, what we call synonyms. Но есть не которые синонимы. Instead of society, вместо общества, it uses a number of words. Есть другие слова похожие. It uses the word. Допустим. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that world, the society. Go into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. That world, that is society. It uses another word for society. It uses the word nations. And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all nations. And as you look at the book of the Acts of the Apostles, it also uses society. But from chapter to chapter, you can see the way it describes society. In chapter 2 of Acts of the Apostles, verse 8 to verse 12, it talks about nationalities. And this nation, and this nation, and this nation. As we talk about the impact of the kingdom on the society, we are thinking about influencing nationalities. Number two. Второй, in chapter 6 of Acts, verse 7, it talks about the orthodox traditionalists. 
conservative no no yevrei the religious religious they lu the orthodox and he really and he traditional, traditional and he religious but they do not know the lord as the personal savior no and this christian is now like actually what gospel is passing and it says we need to look at that society he build an apisana orthodox traditionalists we may dodge the toje shit that is religious they so come to acts of the apostles chapter 8 just to options verse 5 they are near it talks about syncretic samaritans was going to love a patristic maybe the yazish what went by the syncretic samaritans is samaritan it was samaritans Katore. and they had a little bit of the old covenant religion together with the traditions of the nation no, and it's a so mixture it. of everything so yes, machine, yes, a little bible a little dogma a little dogma so yes and it's me a little philosophy so yes and it's very mixing everything together it's me shallow philosophy that's part of society and it told you just options have you ever thought about the orthodox religious people around that was the most simple as cool the proper slav is this i hear that we are reaching out to the old people and it told you just options reaching out to the um orphans veteran is starting reaching out to the drunk Zeti. Have you thought about the people that are religious? No, me spasaim eighty are religious in two genders. In Orthodox tradition, who pravoslav ne da pusi. That's part of society too. Me dojnis na shto manam na da. As we come to Acts of the Apostles chapter eleven, it toje previsiv sarswa. We come across another part of society. The yani adina se da pusi me vidim shi drugoi shas options. The diaspora. Eta da pusi luli katore jivu drugoi shwa na. Those people they went everywhere. Yevre bili rasi ne posra. I know more in their own nation, Israel. And in Billy Rasin, a Podrugim Stranam. And as you look at your country, you can get me smart with this one. Find the people who are foreigners. Yes, to the inner strands is there. The diaspora. And in as well as the diaspora. And part of society. Ludi Katori Jivu Drugim Stranam. As you're thinking about this section and this section, and we have all those leaders coming up, think about this section of society too. It to the inner spasat. We're looking at chapter 14 of Acts. The Yanni Apostle of Shetrina said, and we have the superstitious Gentiles. Yes, to the very she got away, she would me far. They're far away. And if she had the people that Jesus spoke about, no issues, governing at a kick, no, when he said you receive the Holy Ghost, and downs because of a primitive do of the Lord will come upon you. He took set a pretty good number of witnesses unto me. If you put it in Sweden, in Jerusalem, in Judea, in Judea, in Judea, in Samaria, in Samaria, and then he said, Autumnus part of the earth, don't cry as Emily. It's talking about those uncivilized, superstitious Gentiles. In chapter 17, you have another part of society. We call them secular philosophers. The New Testament calls them Epicureans. And when you know there are many kinds of philosophies in the world. And the secular-minded people, the major in philosophy. And the church needs to develop strategy to be able to reach those secular philosophers. When you come to chapter 19, you reach another part of society. Is the trade unionists the people that are very active in defending their trade? Proletariat and all those unions. Raboche, Katore, we how, do you, how do you speak to them? Show me that it's why business. How do you catch their interest? Nada was rabat of a strategy. Knowing that this is part of society you want to reach. Kagame government of options for Nada is vide see segment of options. Five verse twenty three. Vide the cash do a glave biblia yes rasni options for rasni shasti options. Chapter twenty five verse twenty three talks about. Rasni piata glava. The powerful political class. No segment of political and it's society by itself. And it told you just the option. Whatever may be their party. All they are concerned about is the politics. Chapter 28. Verse verse my glass. Verse 1 to verse 9. We have the uncivilized barbarians. May we didn't vapshe ni civilize over ni varva. To reach the people too. As you think about acts of the apostles. 
Parce que tu sous des derniers apostoles. Et tu all those various societies. Parce que des derniers apostoles ont rasé les chasses. They were able to reach them. Oh, ça fait comment tu obtiens ça? Because they had one thing. Et où chez Niki, Smagli a quoi tu sais? That is the key. And this magli aquatif six very options. And today as we're rounding up, and the Lord says, I give unto you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Clouch, that you will use that key. Anywhere you go, any part of your country. Who that be vene pashli? You will be able to open doors. Doors into the hearts of people. The door into the kingdom. The people who appear hardened against the gospel. I just to show the protein evangelist. Yes, they are closed up. That just some is sacrating. I will say there's no way. Those people will never listen. They will listen when you make use of the key. No, can that be preminish at that clutch? He had me preminish. All we need is a key. Me na munch na tolka clutch. And thank God this afternoon the key is here. It's not that God's word is a clutch. Just some is even here. I want to brief. I want to briefly talk to you on penetrating the society with kingdom keys. Yakashu provide us with an attempt. Can Pranik nut vopšesva šeres kluši sarsva. Penetrating the society. At krivat opšesva šeres with kingdom keys. Kluši sarsva. I'm going to first of all talk about the perception. Okay. Understanding. Yes, sir. The proper perception of kingdom keys. Vaperve što abas našaj kluši sarsva. When Jesus told Peter, and as Jesus is telling you, I give unto you the key. What do I understand by the key? What do you understand by the key? When we talk about the key, we talk about that thing that we used to open the door. It may be the door we want to open. Safe. It will be the clush. gate into the city we Mon want to open. Mon it may be the gate into a nation Mon we want be to open. The clush is supposed to open. Clush is supposed to open. So that those who are outside can go in. So be take a tour of ne magleziti. But the key also locks the door. Clushi takje zakriva against what you do not want to enter. Yes, the shivota tini jilai zakroish dweri. But when we talk about the key, so be anonizash lov nu. If you are talking about the car. About the door, about the gate, that's a literal key. But this is electronic age. When you have a computer, when you have a computer, you have a computer, you have a laptop. You have a laptop. Everything you have inside there. I say when you lock up your computer. Anybody can pick up that computer. They will not be able to get into your computer. No, yes, they physically will. Because they do not have the key. And it is more good at create that computer. We call the key. Password. Me shas eta naziva em parol. The Lord is saying. Eta toje klush. In all his electronic system. Vafse elet electronic dela. He has all the software and everything inside there. Siyo tam toje yes rasne klushi. The program to reach your city. Rasne programi. And the program to reach the nation. Shobi zava ivad garada. It's all there in his laptop. Computer. And he says, I'll give you the key, I'll give you the password. Once you have the password, you have access to everything inside the computer. Laptop. You have your computer. You have your resources that you have in the bank. If anybody picked you up your card, your credit card, and then he puts it in, he wants to draw out money from there. He's not going to be able to do that except he has the key. Because they are going to ask him, can you enter your PIN number? He doesn't, he doesn't have the PIN number. He does not have the key. The Lord is saying that all his resources that he has 
you need the pin number you need the password and you need the key login sometimes i want to talk to somebody far away i have a telephone in my hand and then i have some numbers i need to dial they may be six figures or they may be seven or eight and sometimes I punch and you dial. If it remains just one point or just one figure, the way the channel will not be open for you to talk to the other fellow. Sometimes it needs just one figure more. And sometimes of dial quite a lot. So that this one is every one of us here. No, you, you had known the Lord before you came. That's why you wrote that You had got part of the number. And you have dialed this, this, and that. Maybe God brought you here this weekend. So to just just Cluche, no, it will be an equal tight. I didn't go with a cluche to just hear a word from Pastor Sunday. My mother will be fighting on the Sunday, Papa. I told you, any daily show, just an idea. I had not told us love, just a method. I had not told us that all the numbers you have tried to dial. My mother had no strategy, he had no proper good numbers, wonderful numbers. The above lies that Tamuto should to Uje, just the last digit to enter. And then God brought you here. And as Pastor Sunday is talking, I got the point. I see the model. I see the way. The final number I need to enter, I got it now. All of a sudden, you've got the key. All of a sudden, you've got the key. And then you dial and you add the final number and then your way is through Pastor Sunday will be finalizing and preaching tonight I hope everyone is here I am going to be here because it may be the last digit you need the last number to enter and after the after that message, he the proper, he will release you to go back to society. And talk about influence, there's going to be influence on this nation. Because once you have the key, you will be able to open every door. Look at Isaiah chapter 22. Isaiah 22 verse 21 verse 22. Isaiah 22 and you see what the Lord says about the key that the key actually belongs to the Lord Jesus that's why Jesus told Peter I give unto you the keys of the kingdom Isaiah 22 21 I will close him with thy robe and strengthen him with thy girdle and I will commit thy government into his hand and he shall be be a father to the inhabitants of Jerusalem. If last for you, Peredam, looking you all, and to the house of Judah, he unbooted at some like the Jerusalem. key of the house of David will I lay upon his shoulder. He, he doma you dinner, he clush doma so David over. He shall open and none shall shut. Vos lo juna remina you all, at for it on in Nikton is a pretty. That's the function of the key. Zapret, at a yes roll, he will she. open and on, none will be able to shut. On at croy, in Nikton is a croy. He shall shut and none will open. Is a croit in Nicktoniat croit. That's the key he has put in our hand. What a coif last on Nam Dayot. If that is the proper perception of the key. Yes, the me pay me on our show. Should I go close? What is the powerful potentials of the key? The better way to pay over him a potential. That leads me to the second point. Powerful potentials of kingdom keys. We're coming back to that. Matthew chapter 16 again. And we're looking at verse 19. And it says, I will give unto thee the keys of the kingdom of heaven. I will give unto you. 
the keys of the kingdom and is the kingdom of heaven and he says because you have that key you will open Nobody will shut. Say at Croish. You will shut. And nobody will open. Say at Croish. And he says that key. In our head at Will have influence on us. But that image does the best we have. It will influence in heaven. Na nebe ina zemle. Because it says in that verse. Sam na pisa na vetom stiche. Whatsoever. So stobite. I want you to underline that word. Whatsoever. For check nite. Stobite. Whatsoever. Stobite. What could that mean? Show it as nash. Whatsoever. Stosiage. That means whatever. It as nash. Sto go. You ask. Sto go. Whatever you need. Sto de pa process. Whatever you demand. Shom te nushda esa. Whatever your ministry will demand. Shom be de belat for you nushda. Whatever the challenge of the day will demand. Like here be ne believe this of it. It says whatsoever. On gavarit. You bind on earth. Sto sto te siage. That is to use the key to lock the door. It as nash. Close shom. Against any evil. Te moje svizas siako es law. Against anything coming in. Siako any prayer. It says whatsoever you bind on earth. Sto sto te siage. Shall be bound in heaven. Who de svizas and an. And now he talks about the other side. Whatsoever you lose on earth, and it's the key. But it ras viajish na bebe. You know sometimes you see a big, big lorry. In a game vidim, a roche bashem machine. And then somebody that is about uh, 25 years of age or even 21 Kaki he enters into that place. The point is he has the key. And you see at the driver's seat. I told you last night. It doesn't matter the stature of that man. Why the stature of that woman? Was he or she has the key? You see the machine at the driver's seat on Moses, and you put on the ignition key exclusive it machine it will respond if so machine at fish whereas if you're big no that you use it by show and if you're knowledgeable it's just a woman and if you're tall he leave it okay and if you're bold he leave it smell and if you're aggressive he leave it like a good aggressive but you don't have a key no you don't have a key and then you push take the machine and talk up machine nothing happens this she will represent this is not human strength but I'm not sure I'm not sure that he is the answer clush what from what what brings solution is the key even no clush I want you have the key he this afternoon. That key is going to solve the problem. And he says, whatsoever you lose on earth, we be lose in heaven. But that means that if you open, it will open. So you don't have to be watching other people. You know that's what you used to do. Yet. When I hear about a great man, just like that, yes, I used to watch them. I never look at you. I say, what a great man that is. Yeah, then she it told you by us. I hear of this man, America, great. Yeah, was kishau saimi. I was watching them. Yeah, do more boys. I hear of that one in the other place in Germany. Great man. Pamaza ni America, Germany. I hear of another one in Africa. Great man. Africa, Pamaza ni ki. I was watching them. The key was in my pocket. I never used it. Yeah, so for ski shouts, I mean, men that I was supposed to be take this amen clushi. I told you, I believe. And you have the same key that they have. They told you for ski shouts, I'm not really. Why is that happening there? No, and it is not happening with me. Would you be a take this amen clushi? I could not. The only difference is they use the key. I don't use the key. No problem of Tom. So I need pause with a clushi. I'm a drugo. I need pause with one clushi. When you begin to use your key, yes, it's not showing pause, but we clushi. Like he is using. In his key. That on is possessed for equal. Like shit. I am using my key. Ah, yeah, it's possessed for equal. The shit. same scene that is happening here will happen so over so on to our it. Then I should not touch it for it. And you can go out from today. If it's more than the same, having that key, wait, yes, understanding. The national is possessed for equal. So ever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven. So show me ten years, and as I'm living, ten years on an ebb. And whatsoever you lose on earth will be losing. It show me ten years, and as I'm living, ten years on an ebb. Now the powerful potentials. Of such a key, that should yet potential the leak of Klushach. As you come to the Acts of the Apostles, if they are the Apostle of, and you see the things that happen, may we them touch the price card? Remember, the key is to open. Klushi may at revive, and the key is to lock. Klushi may is at revive. Can I just show you a few verses of Scripture? That way, the past month we show in Acts of the Apostles, chapter twelve. They are not even asked. Acts of the Apostles, chapter twelve. They are not even asked. I'm reading from verse five. Peter was thinking. Acts twelve, verse five. When I said Peter, and Peter. 
therefore was kept in prison. Итак, Петра стерегли в темнице. Peter therefore was kept in prison. Заключили Петра в тюрьму. The door was locked. Дверь была закрыта. The chains were put on. И уже все, дела были закрыты. The guards were by his side. Были охранники. And Herod decided the man was locked up. И они его уже закрыли. And there was no way for him to come out. И он не смог выбраться оттуда. By the way, what was Peter doing? Чем же занимался Петр? Петр в тюрьме. He was sleeping. Он спал. He wasn't using the key. Он не использовал ключи. He wasn't asking Lord why am I here. Он не задавал Богу вопрос. He didn't speak a word of authority. Он не позвался власти. He just let what will be be. Он просто сказал, ну раз заключили, буду спать. He said, Lord, Thy will be done. Пускай твоя воля исполнится. You know, before you pray that prayer, не до того как так молиться, Thy will be done. Что твоя воля да исполнится? You must understand the difference between the will of God and the will of Satan. Надо знать, что это точно выяснить, что это воля Бога или это воля врага. You must understand the difference between the will of God and the will of man. Нужно точно знать, что это не воля человека. Sometimes something is happening. Иногда что-то с нами происходит. It may be about our pastor. Может быть, а проблема that they are saying this or saying that. And there are some people that will say, some people that will say, "I will do it." The will of the Lord be done. No, postpone. Is born is a voluntary. What do you mean by the will of the Lord? What do you understand? Should the image be the voluntary abortion? What's the will of the Lord? So voluntary abortion. That Peter remain in prison. Should be what pastor did. That Peter remain asleep. Should be Peter built to remain. That Herod will do whatever he wants to do. Should be Herod who build you. Before you pray, that will be done. Determine and discern what that will of the Lord is. Nizia Molisa poska evo de voluntary abortion. Pakate tosh na ni uverin. So eta voluntary abortion. The great things that God is doing in this church and through this church. It is not the will of God that it will slow down. It is not the will of God that the work of God will be destroyed. It is not the will of God that anybody will silence the man of God. It is not the will of God that souls that ought to be saved are not getting saved. So don't you ever behave like you know you just go to sleep and say, "Let what will be be." Peter did not use the key. But thank God, thank God the believers in the church use the key. You know, sometimes they want to take me from here to there. No, slava Bogu, so very she nispali, and they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're looking for the man that brought me in the morning. No, they're I said you have the key. I said you have the key. Yes, Clushi. If he is not using the key, use your own key. Yes, it ought only is most the Clushi. Today is most the toy Clushi. Sometimes we want to go out here. In a day, we can't even wait. Yes, Uda. And then they are looking for the person to open the door for us. He may issue him to tam tam the jury. And we are standing there. Mishdiom. And the pastor says, "Where is so and so?" The pastor goes, "I get to it." And we cannot find him. I mean, imagine we want to see. He says, "You go and open the door." And since thank God now, you have the key. You have the key. You have the key. If somebody is not using the key, use your own. We're going out. Clushi. Should be taken. 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 Should No, nasha islani mikavari malitwa eta klush. And in this chapter, prayer was the key. If it was Mr. Pesa, then we would show malitwa. And while the church was praying, but klushila klushom. God sent an angel. Entered into that prison. And woke up Peter. And Peter got up. And then there was an iron door. And the door opened by itself. Some people said, you know, you don't have to even use the key. Because the door just opened. No, the people that were using the key to open that door, they were not physically there. They were in the house of John Mark praying. It was a prayer there that opened that door. So there's a key. 
ani ispons vale duhovni klushi e at kreli at temniso what unique vale klushi look at verse 10 pas when they were past the first and the second watch and they came unto the iron gate that leadeth unto the city it opened to them of its own accord pray dear peru if taru straju ani prishlu jeles ni varatam ve dushim gorod katore same sabo at vorilis im ani veshli i prishli i prashli adnu ulisu if drug angela ni stalas neme chapter 20 chapter 16 verse 25 here we find again Paul and Silas. They were in the prison. How did they, they don't open? Believe to me. By the key again. It says in verse 25. And at midnight, Peter, Paul, and Silas prayed. And sang praises unto God. And the prisoners heard them. And suddenly there was a great earthquake. So that the foundations of the prison were, were shaking. And immediately all the doors were open. The praise and the prayer of the people opened the doors again. And I want to say that already the key is in your hand. Yes, clush. Have you, there was uh, sometimes uh, you have an experience. Because you always put your key in a particular pocket or purse. But this particular day you put that key in another pocket. And you checked up the key where you normally put the key. You couldn't find the key. And then you checked other places. In Ishi, Druge, Mesa. You couldn't find the key. In Imog, and then Kushi. you ask this brother. It's for I'm Seda. looking for my key. Ishi, you ask the sister, I'm looking for my key. Ni vide, li mo and you search and search. Ishi. Until you are frustrated. Mo, All of a sudden, so you just put your hand in another pocket. Imo you don't normally put things in. Slushai, no te, na tok nusa, na and lo and behold, the key was there. Have you had that experience before? It happens spiritually too. You're looking for the key. Duhovna me is right there. And you search here and search there. Until you are frustrated. And yet the key is there all the time. No clushi lejalos wezde. God gives the key. Leja clushi He doesn't withdraw what he has given. Kagda bog da yo clushi only soberai shivo. The calling of the Lord and the gifts of the Lord are without repentance. Prince boje bes only jeleit. And the key to open every Every door is ready in our hands. I'm going to talk on the final point now. The purposeful penetration with kingdom keys. Uh, purposeful penetration through the kingdom keys when we want to enter into a city or enter into a society if we do not have the key or know the key or the strategy it will appear will not be able to enter Ecclesiastes chapter 10 Ecclesiastes chapter 10 verse 15 it says the labor of the foolish will yes <laughs> every one of them because he knows not how to go into the city he knows the city is there he knows that society is there. But he labors and labors. And he does not know how to go in. He does not have the key or the strategy. I don't know whether you are learning anything from all that you see as we go from morning to evening for these few days. When we saw all these people that received the word, and they referred to as the Apostolic Council, 
И допустим, видите, это апостольский совет, когда они стояли. Maybe you just sit back and you say, well, that's that, that's their method. Может быть, там сидишь и думаешь, ну, это же апостольский совет, пусть они работают. I'm so much surprised what I see in this church. Но я вам скажу, я лично, несмотря несмотря на мой опыт жизни, я Patricion, or того, что я вижу здесь, and sometimes uh, Pastor Sunday tells me, he says, you need some rest. <laughs> We're not preaching now. You can go and rest. И когда я вижу вашу церковь, и сравниваю с Библией, Библия оживляется. Pastor Sunday мне говорит, не сидите здесь все время, отдохните. Я говорю, не. I said, no, I cannot go and rest. Я не могу отдохнуть при таких чудесах Божьих. I'm some strategies and some wisdom here. Я сам получаю от вас ключи и стратегии. Some doors are opening here. И здесь я начну открывать новые двери. Revelations are coming up here. Who will go and sleep in such a meeting like this? Oh, ya lose any budu spot. I said, Pastor Sunday, I'll do all my sleeping when we finish the conference. Yes, because Pastor Sunday, ya pa yudu damo budu spot. Let me show you the council. Давайте я посмотрю как апостольский council. Апостольский совет здесь работает. The people that have the wisdom to know this is the way the church ought to go. У вас есть апостольский совет точно как Библии. The people that know there is a need there. That's a Bible, yes, apostles, yeah, the Bible is a of The nation. The understanding of the times. The understanding of how do we open this door and this door and, and this door. And we have that apostolic team. And, and if any revelation or vision occurs to you where you are. You know a member of the apostolic team. Team, you have to come to and reveal that vision. First Chronicles chapter 12, verse 32. First Chronicles chapter 12, verse 32. And the children of Issachar, which were men that had understanding of the times. To know what Israel ought to do. The heads of them were 200 and all their brethren were at their command. So Kagdanad Lejala Delat Israelu, Igbilat Veste Glavne, if see Bratia Ik Sledovali Slovu Ik. It was a small group. In the whole nation, they were the people that had the wisdom, the vision, and the understanding of the times. And all the other people of Israel, they looked up to them. They were the kind of uh, the knowledge or the wisdom team of the nation. Group alude last rame. And as you go back to your ministry, Slushete, Vashe Serpe, Vashe Slushene, the tapes of everything you are seeing. Ya Prashuvas, Kupite, Sia Cassette, Sia Propavid, Catholic says Billy. Not just what you call the messages. Nitolka Propavid. All the other things that were done, they are part of the message. It's a different way of communicating. The vision and the wisdom. That God wants us to take back home. So that as you go to reproduce that in your ministry. The same success you see here, you are going to see it in your ministry. And now as God has given us the key. Can I give you a final verse for you to hold on in prayer to? In Psalm 2 verse 8. Psalm 2 verse 8. Here is what the Lord is saying. Look at your nation. Look at your society. Look at the section you come from. And the Lord is saying, ask of me. And I will give thee the heathen for thine inheritance. The Lord is saying this afternoon. Lord, get the key in your hand. The key that will open every door where you go. And then ask of him. The heathen for your inheritance. And the uttermost parts of the earth. For, for your, your, for for your, your possession. Your the Lord says you are going to possess all, all the territories all the section of society that the time to possess has now come. And the success you have heard 
If you are sure misled, all the success you have had about in the ministries of other ministers here, should they say Katori misled? That same success is transferred unto you. Say Uspeke, Muje Boje, and so commit yourself. I know that stoop now. Obey the law. If Shera Sivon and Mevam Pele Dali, Vlast Ivliane, I give unto you the keys of the kingdom. Mevam Dali, Mantu Shera, I pose of Shera. Go out and make use of that. Bo Mevam Dal Klushi Malitwe Itrugi Strategi. And pray to the law. Yes, that this key that I have Stante, I am going to make use of this key and this key is going to work you make up your mind 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 Everything you have learned here, you make a commitment unto the Lord. You make a commitment unto the Lord. That you are going to serve the Lord. That you are not looking back. 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 You and the Lord Himself, oh, God, for the His mighty power, for the midst of His glory, is going to help you. His mighty God, for the up and down, will open. Who the His force will open? Who the His force will open? Nations will open. Who the His force will open? There will be success with the ministry. There will be success. Pray to the Lord. Pray to the Lord. And you tell the Lord. Oh Lord, I take hold of the key. Just for His force with me. I take hold of the key. His force with me. I take hold of the key. Yabu the force was a clusha between me. I am going to use the key. Yabu the force was a clusha between me. Whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven. Oh, so I should destroy it as a blade. Whatever you lose on earth will be used in heaven. Who the fierce and the never sad? The Lord will go with you. Your power by your stable. His power will go with you. He will seal up by your stable. His authority will go with you. He will last by your stable. His anointing will go with you. He will seal up by your stable. You cannot fail. You will pass as hard as by your stable. You will not fail. Can't fight the people of God. He will support you. I will support you. All the keys he has given us. You will see the power he has given us. All the wisdom he has given us. Tell the Lord. I am going to be faithful to the Lord. Tell 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 the Lord. Ya tot kato de rechili ti do konsa ukavo yes eta slova eti stiki korman ya tot kato de rechili do konsa ya shas tavo ya di mistek to rechili iti do konsa na iti temne na iti temne eti stiki ya di mistek to rechili iti do konsa na iti temne eta mesta no is computer a ukavo eta yes malites. Molites, Molites, who can vote yes, Eta? Yeah, Dennis Tech, to the shield, it's not concerned. Yeah, Dennis Tech, to the vote that the shield, it's not concerned. Who can vote yes? Now, it's just for your computer, the item there. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, Elinet. Prince Simne.
Praise the Lord. Slava Bogu. We're going to do something together. This has been a unique conference. You must understand, I've attended, I've attended many conferences. I cannot count the number. And I've listened to many preachers. I cannot count how many of them. But the impact on, of this conference on me this weekend has been tremendous. No, ni had no issue of Papa Vednik, Ili conference, Namina Nitak, Pavliala, Kakvot, Etavasha conference. And because of that, I felt if it could affect me like this, I wouldn't have affected all the other people. I'm making up my mind that I'm going to go back to my own ministry and then to the opportunities of all over the world and begin to work as I never worked before. Slujajte, ni smo tre na došo, ne sem diset let. No postoje toj konferenci, ja vernus da moj. Ja naš nu trudisa, tak kak ja i žio do se poni trudisa. I am trusting the Lord. I am trusting the Lord to enter a new phase, a greater phase, a higher phase of ministry. Ni smo tre na to što mi ja milion i pasledovat ili posle mu miru. No postoje toj konferenci, ribjata. That's the reason why I'm going to lead you in a confession of commitment. This is a commitment I'm making for myself. But I didn't want to make it private for myself alone. That's why I'm going to lead you in that commitment. Those of, those of us who use the English language alone. I will lead you without any interpretation. And, and then after that, Pastor Sunday will lead the uh, rest of the audience in the language here. There is no point having the key and not having a commitment to use the key. But, but we will pray first. And then after that, after the prayer, you accept that you have the key. You believe that you have the key. And you confess that you have the key. A, B, C. A, accept. B, B, believe. C, confess that you have the key. After you know that you have the key, so to be then I lead you in the commitment that we're going to have. I will ready for the prayer. First of all, the key. A, B, C, I possess the key. You will heal the sick. You will cleanse the lepers. You will win souls to the Lord. Your ministry will have multiplied effects all over. 
No impossibility in your life again. No impossibility in your family again. Oh, the key is now in your hand. Let us pray. Raise up your hand, everybody. Father, in the name of Jesus, we come to you at this time. We thank you for the impact of this conference upon our lives. Thank you for your calling. Thank, thank you for the anointing. Thank you for the power. Thank you for the authority. Thank you for the key of giving us. Lord, we accept the key in Jesus' name. Lord, we believe. Because you said, I give unto you. So to your slave, I will receive that which you give right now in Jesus' name. Lord, we have said, said, and we believe that the key is ours already in Jesus' name. And we confess that we have the key now. Every every door, every door will spring open before us. And anything that is not of you. If you are not to be locked out of our ministries, I will pressure my Jesus. Lord, with this key, Gospod, open the door, the door of opportunity, and the door of blessing, and the door of the supernatural, and the door of the miracles, and the door of signs and wonders, and the door of the great breakthrough, confirm it in every life, Lord. Lord, we know your voice will not come to you void. You have said it, and it is done. You have proclaimed it is effective. And we know it is fulfilled in every life. We accept. We believe. We confess. That we have the key. Now. As your people go for us. I pray that we use the key and doors will open before them. Impossibilities will possible before them. Confirm it in every life, Lord. We thank you because we know you have answered. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Man. Now I'm going to lead those who are English speaking. I'm going to lead those who are English speaking. Anglo Gavarashi. And so we close our eyes. Today repeat. And you say this after me. Paftarite, Pajas. Those who speak English. Folk Anglo Gavarashi. Are we ready? Ruski Moshe. English people. I can't hear your yes. Close your eyes. I mean every word of it as we repeat. I am part of the fellowship of the unashamed. I have the Holy Spirit power. The die has been cast. I have stepped over the line. The decision has been made. I am a disciple of Jesus. I won't look back. I won't let down. I won't back away. I will not be still. My past is redeemed. My present makes sense. My future is secured. I am finished and done with low living. With sight walking. With small planning. With smooth knees. With colorless dreams. With tamed visions, with mundane talking, with cheap, with cheap, cheap living, with dropped goals, I no longer need preeminence, prosperity, position, promotion, plaudits, or popularity. I don't have time to be right. I don't have time to be forced. To be taught, to be recognized, to be praised, to be regarded, to be rewarded. I now live by faith. I lean on his presence. I walk by patience. I live by prayer. I labor by power. 
My face is set. My gate is fast. My goal is heaven. My road is narrow. My way is raw. My companions are few. My guide reliable. My mission is clear. I cannot be bought. I cannot be compromised. I cannot be deterred. I cannot be lured away. I cannot be turned back. I cannot be deluded or delayed. I will not flinch in the face of sacrifice. I will not hesitate in the presence of the adversary. Neither negotiate at the table of the enemy. Or ponder at the pool of popularity. Or meander in the maze of mediocrity. I won't give up. I won't shut up. I won't let up. Until I have stayed up. Stood up. Prayed up. Paid up. Preach up for the cause of Christ. I am a disciple of Jesus. I must go until he comes. Give until I drop. Preach until all know. Walk until he stops me. And when he comes for his own, he will have no problem recognizing me. My banner will be clear. And everybody said, Amen. Prepare the vitamin C standing. Paptariti Pajasta at the Pasvishini, Gromka, E. Pered Bokum, Strachum Bojum, Et at Shelovek, Ujetak Jivot, Solkas Kokaya Jivu, No Sor of No Pasvishai Sibezan of Akaj de Dentak Jit. Yasa Krushayos. Yasa Krushayos. Paftariti Pajas. Nina das motri to da. Krusta slushite. At klushite se krana. Paftariti. Kajite. Ya. Adini stech. Tot vorda rishio. Iti. Dokonsa. Gromshe. Ya adini stech. Tot vorda rishio. Iti do konsa. Umenya net puti nazad. Ya priest to pill share tu. Ya at kazausa o jist na nova uyuta. Ili komforta. Resheni e priyata. Ya usheni kisusa krista. Ya ne buda glade vasa. Niasla Bayu Nisa Med Lutemp Nipa Vernu Razad Moyo Prosh Loya is Kuplina Moyo Nastaya She has missed Lena Moyo Budu She Besa Pastosti Yana Sekdapa Conchil Niska Sort No Ejis Nayu as didn't put a bush in it. Nis na shit and me plan na me. Best vet ni mis na me. Is kajon in vidinium. A bed in me rasgavora me. Scoop him dianium. In a concrete ni misselia me. Ya. Adini stek, to tvoda ne shil, iti do konsa. Ne boše ni nužna slava, me ja boše ni interesuje paloženje, 
Ме Боже ни нужда популярност. О, не не обязательно би правим. Не не обязательно би первим. Не не обязательно би та верху. Я не зависим от признания и уважения. Я не жду похвали от людей. И не ищу награды. Я один из тех, кто решил идти до конца. Я принял решение жить в присутствии Бога. Двигаться верою. Любить терпением. Дышать молитвою. И трудиться с усилием. Мой взгляд твой, моя сел небесное царство, моя дорога узка, мой путь тернист, у меня немного спутников, но мой проводник надежен, и миссия ясна, меня невозможно купить. Заставить пойти на компромисс. Удержать или соблазнить. Меня невозможно заставить повернуть назад. Или вести в заблуждение. Меня не смогут остановить. Я не дрогну при необадим осуществовать собою. Не буду сомневаться, когда придет нечасти. Не сяду за столом переговора с врагом. У меня не будет головокружения от популярности. Я не буду бродить в ламбаринте, называемом непосредственностью. Я не сдамся. Не замолчу, не ослабею и не сгору, пока я не закончу говорить, не закончу молиться, пока я не заплачу всю сцену, не соберу весь урожай и не вестаю за крестом до конца. Я... Один из тех, кто твой решил идти до конца. Я ученик Иисуса Христа. До его прихода я должен продолжать идти. Идти вперед. Я должен отдавать. Пока имею Проповедовать, пока все они не познают, и трудиться, пока он меня не остановит. И когда он придет забрать своих, ему не будет трудно знать меня, потому что я Посвятил свою жизнь тому, чтобы твердости идти до конца. Боже! Слава тебе!
Applaudimenti, vos clissani e bogu. Adaite bogu slavo. Ya tuoda le shili tido konsa. Ya tuoda le shili tido konsa. Ya tuoda le shili tido konsa. Mi ya pa prosil sho be pastor kumuyi. Eta pas legna ivo malit vas des pika ombude. Pristavte Isusa perisa boy. Увидьте его ноги, которые, ну, где, где гвоз где стоят. Раны в его ногах, как пастор Наташа учит. Давайте доберемся до этой раны, ногах его. Представьте себе, как ребенка в его, но, у его ноги. Обнимите эту крововую ноги. О, давайте спрокникнемся в, в, в эту дырку, в эти, в эти дырки, в эти раны, в эти крови его ноги. Нежно прикоснемся и скажем, Господь, я твой, я твой нарешил идти до конца, пока пастор будет за нас молиться. Держи за Иисуса, увидь это, обними эту ногу Иисуса и проникся в эти раны его и посвяти душу и сердце. Yes. Это спрос. Let's raise our hands to the Lord as a sign of total surrender to the Lord. You have just one life to live. Whatever whatever you do today will be rewarded in eternity. And it's better to lay everything down Brother, I died for you, Jesus Christ. At the feet God. of the cross. I died. Thank you, be boshe yoni so brat Christa. He gave you salvation. I died, Christ too. I died. He gave you the Holy Ghost. On I died for you, Jesus. He gave you the key. On that to be close. He wants to give you heaven. On oh shit, be that neighbor. You have laid everything down now. Pajau, I died. Se be a You have laid a commitment to the Lord. I died. Yemu se be a shu gospel ni shivo me yani udeshi. You can lead thousands and millions to the Lord. Father, in the name of Jesus, once again afresh, as if we never did any other thing before, we want to start a fresh service. We lay everything we have, everything we are at the feet of the Lord Jesus Christ. Not thinking about ourselves. Not seeking just personal benefit or profit. We want to touch the lives of thousands and millions. And Lord, everything we have, everything of today, we are, everything we have, everything we have, we lay everything at the foot of the cross. Use what we have, Lord. 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 Use Oh, you protect the pastor and his wife. Protect the whole ministry and membership. That this great thing you have done in this nation of Ukraine will move beyond Ukraine to the whole of Europe and to the whole of America and to the whole of Asia and to the whole of Africa and to the whole of China and to the whole of India all over the world in all the continents we pray that your glory your power the gospel the light will come out of this place move all over the world once again Lord we all surrender and commit ourselves use us for your glory and protect what you have given your people the key is in our hands already let doors open the door everyone confirm your miracle and blessing upon everyone reproduce the life of Christ reproduce the ministry of Christ in every one of your people here
We thank you, Lord. We give the glory to you. The Lord is done. In Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. What's Christ mean? That is love of God. Papa Granite Pastor. Applaudisment of God. Yanis Lishuas.